What up, players? Wobots Tay up in this mood. Today, for Spooky Tober Fest, I have an unboxing of the Dark Eldar Slith. It's in Citadel Fine Cast, so we're gonna see how screwed over we get by our favorite gaming company as we put together this model. Inside the sprue, we've got, or inside the clamshell, we've got two sprues. We have just enough arms. Four arms. We've got the torso in one piece and the tail in another piece. And we've got the head. So no messing around, no alternate parts, no nothing different. Looks like the arms can be interchanged with regular Dark Eldar Warrior arms or witch arms even. Actually no, it looks like the these arms have these armor plates on it which really make them Dark Eldar warrior looking with these gauntlets and stuff so so that's what we will build him up as maybe an interesting thing might be if I want to buy and build up another slith is to give him other arms other dark Eldar warrior arms and save these and give them to something else but for this one I will build him as is so you can see what it's supposed to look like and I'm gonna do that now I'm gonna clean up the different parts of the sprue and I will put it together and we'll show you what it looks like in just a bit. So here's my finished slith. I haven't seen anything resembling a miscast yet, but there do seem to be some little cracks in the model like there where the head meets the torso where I'm gonna need to go in with some liquid green stuff. And um, I noticed when I was putting this guy's tail to his body, I was like looking at the mold lines on the bottom and I realized that this looks exactly like the sculpt for the tail for the fine cast cockatrice. And um, sure enough, like the, the way the tail is curved, just like the, the, I'm thinking about like right here where the curve of the tail is, not here at the end so much, but where the, even the, the shape of the scales and the, the belly of the of the, of the serpent-like part of the snake just is so reminiscent of the fine cast cockatrice just on a smaller scale that I'm surprised I hadn't noticed sooner. For anybody who has both models, do you agree? Or do you think that this is a totally different and original sculpt? Because they looked very similar to me. Anyway, here's the model. He looks really good. The, the head of the snake looks really good and detailed and the armor plates and everything look really dark Eldari. And I'm gonna go away and paint this up and do a Warboss painting tutorial on him. And that should be coming up in the next couple of days. So we'll see you then. <laughs> 